What's good, everybody? Bass Drop Keys, your friendly neighborhood Negro, and welcome to another episode of Good Eats. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to make Green Dragon. That's right. The cannabis tincture. I'm going to show you how to make it right now. So let's go ahead and get into it. Let's do it. All right, so let's go ahead and get this thing started off. The first thing you need to know is that you need to decarb your cannabis. Now I've already done a video on how to decarb your cannabis. I will put a link in the description, but that's the first thing. Make sure you decarb your cannabis and now we can go on to the next step. Okay, so this is a very simple recipe in order to make Green Dragon. We're using Everclear grain alcohol. It is 95%, 190 proof. Here in America, we can find it at most liquor stores. I'm not sure exactly where you can get it if you're not uh, in America, but you wanna use grain alcohol. That's what we're using right now. Uh, we have the inside of our magical butter machine all clean. And this is very simple. We're gonna go ahead and just pour in the entire bottle. This is a 750 milliliter bottle, which is a little over three cups. We're gonna go ahead and pour it in. After that, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and add in our decarbed cannabis. It's 25 grams right here that we're adding in. And then I remember by chance that earlier in the day, I decarbed some cannabis previously. So right here is another seven grams. So this is a total of 32 grams that we're using to make the green dragon. Okay, so from this point right here, it's very easy. We're gonna go ahead and close up the magical butter machine. We're gonna go ahead and put it on 130 degrees, which is the first setting. And you can go ahead and put it on number four right there where it says tincture. But if you want it stronger, go ahead and hit where it says number eight and make it very strong. So that's what I went ahead and did. With a part of this tincture, we're gonna be using to make some sour can of sugar and some regular can of sugar for my gummies and just to have some regular can of sugar. So I want this as strong as I can get it. Okay, so this right here is a couple hours in. I turned off all the lights so just so you can see something cool. A little light show. Pretty cool, right? All right, so the eight hours is officially over. It's been sitting a couple hours as I went to do some shopping to get a couple things. I have my Pyrex measuring cup right here and I have the filter bag inside of here. Inside the filter bag, I have some coffee filters. I'm doing that just so it can have some extra filtration because I want this to be as clear as possible. And we don't want any sediments in our final product. As you can see right here, I'm opening in the magical butter machine and inside is our green dragon. Okay, so we're gonna start pouring it inside of the bag with the coffee filters inside of there. We're gonna just pour it slowly and give it as much time as it needs. This is not the point where you wanna rush it. So yeah, so just let it go ahead and do its thing. I'm gonna go ahead and show you what's in here. Oh, look at that. So that is what remains of the cannabis that's inside of the magical butter machine after the process is gone when it run in to make our tincture. All right, so after that, you just filter it. Remember the coffee filters are in there. Go ahead and squeeze out all of the liquid, the Everclear, the green dragon that you can. We don't want to waste anything. So try to squeeze out as much as you can. And right as I say, we don't want to waste everything. I'm wasting stuff right on the counter, but it's okay. Just try to do as best as you can. All right, so that was just the first time that it's being filtered. As you can see here, I set up another strainer with a coffee filter and we're actually gonna actually filter it again. So I'm gonna go ahead and pour this in here. The green dragon, you can see that it's green. And we're just gonna pour it in here and we're gonna let it sit and we're gonna let it actually uh, filter through the coffee filter. This right here is gonna take some time. You're also gonna have to change out coffee filters uh, once doing this. Just be patient, don't rush it. And right here, if you do a good job, there won't be any sediments, there won't be anything in our final product. So just make sure that you take your time 
and do what you're supposed to do. Don't rush it. Don't break it. Take your time. All right, so you can see me changing the filter. You're gonna have to change the filter at least one time whenever you're doing this. It does drip slow, but if you want it to be filtered the right way, don't trip, don't rush it. What I did do is I went ahead and got a second one to make the process a little faster. So I went ahead and uh, set up the second one. We have both of them going now to make the process uh, a lot faster. So I'm gonna go ahead and skip to the end and show you what it looks like at the end. All right, so here it is. Filtered Green Dragon. It looks amazing. Here's the other one. Looks amazing, no sediments nothing floating in it. Now the only thing that we need to do is we need to go ahead and put it in our bottle, which I'm actually going to put it back in the bottle that it came in. You guys remember we're using Everclear, so we're going to go ahead and grab the funnel and we're going to go ahead and put it right back in the bottle. So let's go ahead and do that right now. And there you have it, 750 milliliters of Green Dragon Cannabis Tincture. What I'm going to be doing with this is I'm going to be making all kinds of things with it. But the first thing I'm going to be making is some sour gummies and sour can of sugar. Those videos are going to be coming soon. Make sure that you like the video. Please subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Tell your friends about the channel. I really appreciate you as always. Peace.